now we're going to teach colgadas. Colgadas is an off-axis movement that hangs. So colgar means to hang. So when you colgar something, you hang it. And uh, to practice it, it's, it's good to take yourself in practice position and uh, think back when you were young and you lean like so and you round around like in the park. The difference here in tango and in dance is that we don't throw our shoulders back because it's too much to hold. So what we do is we bend our knees and we pull from our tailbones. And this, this is what creates the colgada. Never, ever do this. You might fall in the dance floor. So it's the same concept of keeping your spine straight from the base of your spine to the crown of your head, and you're just gonna pretend like you're gonna sit on a chair, keeping your back straight. Since our heads waste too much, that'll send us off. Right. You can practice this to get the feeling of a colgada. We're gonna teach you a colgada from the from a side parada here. Now, we're gonna send the follower out. By stretching your elbows slightly. And I will receive that and stretch it from my hip. Right. I'll pretend like I'm sitting on the side of a chair. Right. And I make sure to fill my partner's hand. Notice that I, we move together. As I send her out, so do I. I send myself out. Yes? Once you send the follower out, you have to shift your weight like so. So you're go all going to be on one leg, which would be the right for both of you. And then you turn. So you're gonna go side, parada, colgada, and then you're gonna step back to create the turn. Let's do it in one motion. Don't be afraid to do a small one at first. It, a colgada can be like this. But we want to show you something that you can aim for. 